I would be heartbroken and I would be angry. That from Winnipeg Police Chief Danny Smythe when asked how he'd feel if one of the alleged victims of accused serial killer Jeremy Skibicki was his family member. Head of Forensics Cam McKidd said the May search of the Brady landfill for Rebecca Contois was made easier because the site was isolated quickly with the help of GPS on city dump trucks. The debris in this site was, as you, as you would sort of expect, when a dump truck would dump debris, um, it's, it's above grade, it wasn't compacted, and it made this search, uh, the conditions for this search. Um, a second landfill, Prairie Green, is heavily compacted with tons of clay, animal waste, and other debris dumped since investigators became aware of it as a potential site. Police believe Morgan Harris and Mercedes Myron may be in the Prairie Green landfill, while the location of the fourth victim, now known as Buffalo Woman, hasn't been determined. These are human beings. How can you even fathom the idea to leave them there? These women are deserving of a proper resting place, not to be left alone in a landfill in the dead of winter. If you want to respect and honor them, stop making excuses as to why you can't find them. You can. You are just refusing to. Leanne Sanders, APTN National News, Winnipeg.